I think they're still going to nuke, but might as well be safe. Get rid of them, boys. Oh, my God. Let's see how you like this. See ya. Oh, my God. Woo. Delicioso. Oh, oh. All right, boys. So this is a requested um, SR unit because we're going to have some fun with the um, PP rule, which is increase the SR units base stats by 85%. Our units get 100% base stats increase. So we're going to be using King Arthur himself, or the SR version. He has a detonate card. So for each orb, the opponent has the 20% more damage. Um, he also has the AOE card, which is a disabled recovery skill card, which no one ever use a healer in PP anyways. He also has this ultimate, which decreases the defense rate of stats by opponents by 40%, which is a single attack, if I'm not mistaken. He has his passive, which every time he takes damage, you get 6% of HP related stats boosted. And it stacks up to five times, so it can go all the way up to 30% HP related stats boost to himself. Not everybody, to himself. So we're going to use this team. This was a recommended team. Um, I tell people all the time, comment down below SR units or R units you want me to showcase. And I'll see what I can do as much as I can. <laughs> it's been really, really a lo little struggle with level 90. All these units I only try to level 90, the only the fun ones I like. So we got Tarmiel, the one Esker, and Gother. Okay, it was a goddess S team. Um, I'm probably gonna rank up more so to um the boy, or maybe I can rank up to everybody. Ah, uh, no, nah, I don't want to get hit with Ignites. So I'm going to go to Arthur right here and then waste this card. I should have just tried to take away his gauge, but l let's be honest, man. He's going to probably just push for gold cards on D1 Asker either way. Oh, my God. He has attack on. Yeah, he has attack set on D1 Asker. I could have just nuked this guy. Because now I know he has attack set. Probably crit damage. So that man lost so much HP from that. Yeah, he's going to go for his gold card now. Yep. He's going to nuke um, Arthur. Wait, wait, what? The Dociel? Huh? Um, okay. He goes for the Dociel. Interesting choice. Interesting choice. I do say so myself. Do you have like Estros in the back? Why would you go for that, man? Wait, what do you do to you? Guess I'll just do this to him. Finish him off. Again. And debuff. He has Tarmiel, so I gotta be careful with that. But you should be gone. Mm mm mm. What a. What a sad, sad, sad man. And guess I am gonna keep throwing out the go to debuffs on a detonate unit that I'm showcasing. And he has Goddess a bit in the back. What the? Okay. So I'm about to spam mad detonate cards. On this guy. Or I can just go for a debuff. He doesn't have no DPS on his team. He literally don't. I guess Tarmi don't Tarmi count as a DPS. In some way. In some way possible. Alright, I'm gonna do this. And then debuff again. I think he's dead right here. Yeah, he is. <laughs> oh my god. Wow, that was so close to killing him off. I wonder if he's going to go for a stun or something crazy. Because that was literally right there. It was right there for the Taken. Um, I have more Zeldra's card, so hopefully he goes for a stun on Arthur because he's spooked. He's definitely going to go for Arthur because he's spooked right now. Unless he's about to go for double stuns. It, he can't be doing that, right? He has to be throwing up a shield. Yeah, this man was mad spooked. Well, at least we get rid of his own Gother. That, that was fun. And we get to waste our card right there and go for you. So I wonder what he's going to do now. I wonder. What are you going to do, my guy? It's already over. And we took off half your HP. Oof. Oof. Feels so bad. Yes, Tarmia, please save him with my gauge. So I can get my ultimate right back. <laughs> I feel like Tarmiel is going to take away my gauge right here. And you're dead. See ya, Tarmiel. It was good knowing you. Good knowing you, sir. 
Um, I'm gonna go for this then. Debuff. Like I said before, he should be done for because you know we are got we do got our base stats increased right now. So see ya. Oh my god, that damage. I just did that just in case. And he does forfeit. Alright, so we have an Ellie Hawk team. 286k. Mmm, okay. I'm gonna save up my Arthur cards right now. For now. Uh, I wanna see if he's gonna stack up his Ellie Hawk cards. I could go for a debuff on this guy right here and just waste this. I wanna make sure he has enough gauge at this moment. Just so I can do full damage to Ellie Hawk. Or at least do enough to um kill her off. It looks like she's close. Looks like she's close. Bruh, if I lose this Purgatory Bond team, <laughs> we about to use um Liz. <laughs> I'm tired of this. I can't. I can't. I understand with Lucia I'm doing extra damage, but man. Having that ability to um stop crits and all that is way better. Came in came in back. Came in back with you guys. Um Yeah, keep filling up your gauge, my guy, so I can nuke your perk type bond. Um yeah. I'm just gonna move my cards. Just so I can kill off Perkinsite Bond afterwards. Oh my god. You're, you're critting. This is a miracle. <laughs> Perkins Yo, Arthur critting, dude. Holy. Who would have thought? Who would have thought? Well, Perkinsite Bond really can't do much. He, he didn't have Twiggo in the back. Or Grimoire, so... He won't do that much HP damage, which is why he's probably going to attack more so. Oh, he is ranking up. Okay. Well, you better hope you kill. Because this is blue versus red. And you already lost your passive from Gother. See? And how many times he got hit? He got hit multiple times, right? I only got hit once. Well, my HP related stats are getting boosted, so I should be able to heal back up. I'm going to debuff this guy real quick. And also use my detonate card. I think they're still going to nuke. But might as well be safe. Get rid of him, boys. Oh, my God. 597. I didn't think it would do that much damage. I'm not even going to lie. <laughs> All right. He's critting. He's critting. This man has Tarmiel on Gother. What the? Yo, am I seeing this right? Tarmiel on Gother? I swear he keeps getting like high HP back. Unless he had... No, 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 no. I don't think he had the buff on him. He must have like something like Tarmiel or something. I swear I saw like 38k just healed up. That must be from the buff. I must be seeing things. Um... Yeah, I was seeing this probably the HP buff thing. I'm like, what is going on? So I'm just gonna probably do something like this then. Attack the one Escanor. Again. Bow. Come on, man. Let's see. Let's see that in action, boys. Now, if he doesn't kill off Arthur, he's gonna get nuked. If he does get kill off Arthur, he's getting nuked. Because then I'll have my ultimate gauge on Ludosia, which means I get my ultimate. So he's already done for, boys. This man is going to get hit, clapped so hard, man. He don't know what's coming out, coming for him. He actually goes to Ludosia right here. <laughs> All right. He chose, he chose right. He chose right. How much gauge do you have? Um. Oh, man. We own that, boys. We own that. I mean, I can attack multiple times as well and kill him off. Go for mad gold cards on this guy. Mad gold cards. Let's see how you like this. See ya. Oh my god. Woo. Delicioso. Oh, oh. Mmm. That has some stank on it. Ooh. Any forfeits. GG. Um, Gluey the team. I guess it's probably gonna be a last matchup for me. Ludosio have been have been doing um he been doing his job. I'll say that man, he been doing his job. 
So we're gonna rank two up to Arthur, I suppose. Might as well. And um, let's go for this. A debuff, just so you don't push for his ultimate on us. He could possibly stun us. Um, remember, I'm using just Merlin because um, Saria was not critting for me. And Merlin is giving me 20% more crit chance, so keep that in mind, guys. Keep that in mind. I wonder if he's going to actually go for stun, though. Or he's going to let me do serious damage to him. Oh, he's going to attack, too. I don't think he kills off Arthur. This is a gold card right here. I don't think he kills. Yeah, I'm about to say he doesn't kill. And remember, he's boosting up my HP related stats as well by doing so. By doing that. Um, but yeah. You can just probably do something like this. Hopefully this might kill him off. But let's see. Let's see what happens. Oh my god, that damage. Oh my god, dude. That man is getting destroyed. That man got destroyed right now. And remember, we still got Ludosio cards in our hand. So we can break Goddess Elizabeth's shield pretty easy right now. Yeah, this man is panic panicking right now. He saw all that Arthur damage. Oh my god, don't tell me you actually buffed yourself up even further. No way. He buffs himself even more. Didn't you, didn't you already take enough damage, my guy? Jeez. All right. Well, I can hope that I kill him off right here. Don't have any other cards but that. To at least break the shield. Yeah. I might as well have go for, gone for that. And Gotha had the most gold cards in his hand. Oh, my God, dude. You're so down bad right now. Dude, you're so down bad. God's little bit has to do something right here. And unfortunately, I have no cards with um with OCL really. So if he stuns my Arthur, I'm done for. In a way. Because he's gonna push for God's little bit ultimate. It's literally guaranteed. And it looks like he is going for a stun. Now what he doesn't know is I'm still able to nuke with um Arthur. This man go for all them stuns? Holy. Um, ooh, so maybe we might be able to break the shield and then go for the one Escanor, which is a big problem for us. Oh my God. Can I break the shield, please? Oh my God. You so lucky. Holy dude. We couldn't break the shield. I should have just probably used the little CL card first. So I have a chance to break the shield. That sucks. Now he's going to probably push for the one Escanor ultimate. Which I will get rid of my Gother for this. If it if it costs me my Gother, for me not to take up the one asking ultimate, I'm definitely gonna just get rid of my Gother. Wait, did I not say full HP? Is that not six out six Goddess Elizabeth? That definitely didn't say full HP. This might not be six out six Goddess Elizabeth. I don't know. I feel it in my I feel it in my soul. It's not. And it's not six out of six. See, boys, this is what <sighs> I felt it in my heart. I felt it in my heart, boys. Sometimes you gotta feel it. I think I could actually. Nah, two hundred forty-six. Nah. If it was a gold card, then yeah. <laughs> but I'm not gonna play that game. I'm not gonna play that game. And I guess do that. Let's have some fun. Since he's not six out of six. Once I saw he, his his own the one that didn't go to full HP, I just knew this man wasn't real with six out of six. But he got nuked regardless. I guess it didn't matter. Oh my god, an Eliog team. So I have to try to get rid of Eliog as quickly as possible. He was 286k, so could he potentially be... Um, could he potentially be the one Escort in the back? Um, I'm going to just start off with my debuff card, maybe. And try to debuff him as much as possible. Let's try that out. I know I shouldn't be wasting these debuffs, but it's for a good cause, boys. For a good cause. I have to make sure Ellie Hawk just dies instantly. I have to make sure for um science. So it all depends on what his Gotha does right here. If he debuffs me as well, or he goes for I don't know Ellie Hawk cards. Oh, he doesn't. Okay. 
but he does buff up and he ranks up to Ellie Hawk, which was very, um, <laughs> that was guaranteed. The only bad part about this now is now he has no, um, gauge on Ellie Hawk now. So I can hope that I might kill with this card, but it's going to be a complete waste. Unfortunately. Oh, I shouldn't have did that then. <laughs> I didn't think I would crit. I honestly didn't think I would crit right there. So if he pushes for his um perks a bond ultimate, I'm done for it, most likely. Unless I kill off the one Escanor. So let's see what perks a bond does. He might try to push for his ultimate. Yeah, he does push for his ultimate right here. That was literally like guaranteed. He goes for Arthur, which he doesn't even kill me off. Wow. He debuffs again. Is he going to literally just spam that? He's going to spam that on me. So since he got maximum gauge, we're just going to do this. Um, I might as well just spam this and use Arthur card for the last one. Oh my God. It did a lot of damage either way. Holy. I was not trying to do that much damage to this guy. I keep mis misjudging the damage. <laughs> I, that is really that's really what's causing me to match the matchup right now is me misjudging the damage that I'm doing. Cause I literally could have just been um saving so much trouble if I just knew how much damage I was supposed to do. Okay. I think he just did that just to get the HP back up. Um, so what I'm gonna have to do is probably um, kill off, kill off him. Um, how much HP does he have on Perkins A Bond right now? 311. I would have to crit to probably get rid of him. So I'll probably just have him waste his card slots, unless I was able to crit right here. Yeah, I probably wouldn't gonna be able to crit. 259. All right, so he's probably gonna get rid of Arthur right here. Um, I think Gother might survive all this, but even if he kills off Gother and all that, we still gonna have our merge and our ultimate. So I guess it's gonna be last matchup. This dude just nuke us. Did he just literally just nuke us? Oh my God, you have to be kidding me, bro. This guy legit just nuked us. You have to be joking, bro. He was 6 out of 6. 311 HP. Oh my god. Wow. And I did 201. Whoa. Did I just do 201? <laughs> uh, I'll take it. I did 201 with that. Alright. So you're going to get nuked. Regardless. What GG my dude. 164. We're gonna go for ultimate. I thought I would instantly lose this matchup, but um, yeah, it's looking pretty good for me. So GG. I thought I was gonna lose because he did uh, instant nuke on us, but it's already GG. Yeah, we got those good old RNG, and he was able to nuke his purgatory bond, especially since he didn't buff up. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video with me using um Blue Arthur. It's actually pretty fun using this guy. He had some moments where he was able to crit. Um, <laughs> I switched it for uh, Merlin instead of Sario because that man was not critting at all on any of my matches. Even with Ludocio, um passive as well. So I just said, forget it, man. I'll just run Merlin. That's 20% more crit chance, which means it's going to be higher for me to get a crit on my AoE and also my single attack card. So that was just me. If you want to try to test your luck with the crits on with Sario, be my guess, but me, I just chose Merlin just because I want them crits easier. But again, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. And sorry again for um the freaking volume on um that slime room rule video. That stuff was very unexpected. I thought I changed the audio levels, but sometimes you gotta take them L's. But hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys like and subscribe again. This is really and I'm out. Peace.